the lob for Serge. There he is. Yep. Drew finding him. And Serge Ibaka has his first bucket as a Milwaukee Buck. Just Simons from up top, and he's coming off a 30-point game against the New York Knicks, a, a game where they had to rally from 23 down. How about that the Bucks use? Matthews checking in for Middleton, who's now in some foul trouble, picked up a couple of fouls. But obviously a little bit short-handed at the, the wing position. Missed! Knocking down 47% on all mid-range jumpers, so he's got that ability. You talk. Remember, the Bucks picked up 36 assists in that first meeting against the Trailblazers on February 5th. Two working it. Like Three points. They're moving the ball. They're a lot more active. They're defense. They're giving a really good, strong effort, especially this guy, just Gilbert, for at least a month. Yeah, he's got a huge opportunity. And Dante DiVincenzo, as we know, traded away to Sacramento. The flush for Nurkic. Located guy at seven feet. 300 pounds sprinting down the middle of the floor, and you said Nurkic. Okay. <laughs> Wara's shooting ability can make up for some of those struggles if West continues. Drew wants to take it a step back. Bucks will attack when the Blazers go to their switching defense. Not so much attacking post ups, but attacking outside mismatches on the perimeter. Then hard answers back. A nice, nice follow up inside on the offensive rebound. Simons with that crossover trying to go right at the rook. The NBA, as we know, when he was 19 years old, he's 22 now. In his fourth year here in the league. We get 10. Oh, four point possible. Now. And, and the Bucks play, play. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, yeah, but he's but he's making some, some great effort plays at the defensive end of the floor. Eight early points total. That was Serge Ibaka. Just a good aggressive screen off the off the basketball. Oh wow! There you can see the sky three. Comes Middleton. Gives it up to Body. Steps right into that. From off. Is that a ten? Says no. Is it to Ibaka? The turnaround. They wanted a goaltending, but we play on instead. Elijah Hughes gets a running start to make a spectacular. Going to scale down, play a little bit smaller. Portis and Ibaka could get some second opportunities, second chance opportunities because of it. Hart gets another bucket. There's gold at that rim. Even with Serge on the floor, Blazers with a nice job attacking. Grayson looking for it. Because you're just, you're just not the same. If you're shooting hand, every time he gets hit, every time you catch a pass the wrong way, you re-enter that thing, and it just never gets better. You just turn off the TV when it gets close. <laughs> oh, boy. You're smart for three. He knocks it down. Battling him, getting up into his airspace. Kind definitely of, making him think yeah, a little yeah, bit. Trying to take him out of the game. Then they just take him out of the game offensively. Since the start of the year, had a huge fourth quarter against the Knicks. And that comeback victory. So, but you got to be, you know, got to be, got to be weary. Individual ball handling, trying to attack the zone, get it middle, collapse the zone, and then look and see what you got. Your science trying to go back to back, and he does. Defensive possessions in a row by the Blazers in the zone. They work it around. Mr. Trouble. Mr. All to the good. Meanwhile, there is a, clearly a, a group of Blazer fans that kind of want that lottery pick. <laughs> Drew with the Hold it for one shot. Simon's dribbling through the whole Bucks defense. He doesn't mean literally. No, I meant literally. Go out here. <laughs> Get on the injury reserve. <laughs> First possession is team is playing defense, Lisa. That's one thing that they did not do before the trade day. Yeah, much improved look, and there's Nurkic with his second. You know, in, in this league, you can give, give guys open looks. Here's Grayson Allen, who will pull and fire hits. Bobby Portis and Serge, keeping Nurkic away from the offensive rebound. He's long, he has tremendous size. Holiday flips it up with the left. Ibaka. Defending there on the block, the kick out that time. Winslow. This is uh, Valentine's Day, so John Walsh just said in my ear, no woman, no cry. Josh <laughs> 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 Hart. Begin <laughs> commenting on the scarf game. Serge Ibaka possessed. All right, here we go. I think Coach Bud 
His idea is that the faster you play offensively, the more energy you're going to bring up the defense. Simon sizing it up. The pass. Here comes Middleton on the push. Looking for it. Here's Drew taking it inside. Oh, 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 he just fooled everyone. But as opposed to having him play against Philly coming in you know, three games in four nights. Flips it up here for the Bucks, slowly but surely trying to get back into this one. Work it around. Slow kicks it out. Simons has had the hot hand. And movement, moving, equal opportunity, offensive approach. Oh, oh, he got blocked right at the rim. About that, the way he, he's just embraced that role as the offensive leader, as young as he is. It's a little bit less of an expensive roster to go in for Hart. The kind of game that he has, and the kind of game that this has been going, but Hart steps into the passing lane. He's got a clear. Well, I love Josh Hart. First possession here of the fourth. Defensive stop here. Out and running. How about that pass? Chris Middle. 3 of 14. 1 of 7, 2 from 3 for Chris tonight. Wigginton looking to force a turnover. Here comes Laura all the way. Finishes. McLemore hands it off. Watford through. Good defense again. Here the Bucks come. Holiday pulls, fires, hands. Wigginton on the floor. Crucial minutes here in this comeback attempt. Look at what you got for this. That defense. He, yeah, did, you see the, did you see the reaction you know, that he gave after he was scored on? Yeah. Jordan Laura, he'll take it inside. Or he'll take it inside. Goes off. Just kind of used the floater finishes, and used some finesse. But really effective. Simon's looking for it and he finds it. Pull it up. He's been off his last three or four jump shots, but he's gotten high quality looks for Chauncey Billy. Here's Holiday back the other way to lead the Bucks here tonight. Seven point deficit. They're trying to whittle into. Don't need that. You have not been watching those fans in Portland a lot of this game because this team has looked really good. That would be really challenge. good. Chauncey's looking for an identity. Yep. Slowly but surely, they might be working their way to that kind of identity that he wanted to try to coach and shape this basketball team to.